I think it's going to rain. First, let me start with, sorry I did not tell you how old Harrison is in yesterday's vlog. I forgot. I forgot. You ready? You guys were mostly way off. Sean, congratulations. He is 18 years old. 18! He's young! He's a young, he's a young pup. But uh, he works with me, so anyway, that's how old Harrison is. Congratulations, Sean. Boom. All right, in the meantime, I gotta get a lot of work done before this rain comes. So, cheers. I hope you guys are having a beautiful day and working hard and... Got the camera and spilled the coffee on me. a uh, perspective shot so notice the lines of the house running that way it gives depth to the shot oh wait sorry I'm in focus here we go here comes the perspective there it is see it see it long lines running all the way down the house and that gives depth to the shot and I'll talk more about this on Friday of this week when I do a little tutorial on how to vlog all right capiche So uh, this is how this is where my expertise breaks down when it comes to the scientific side of the eyesight, but that depth of field is really attractive to the human brain and to the human eye. Why that is, I don't know, but that it's all about that depth of field. Anyway, if anyone knows, comment below on why like the brain registers really well with perspective shots. Just cleaning the uh, cleaning the recycling bin. Hot water, soap. Let it sit for a little bit. Dump it out. Be golden. We'll be golden, everybody. Boom. Believe it or not, these cameras are incredibly waterproof. I've seen YouTube videos of people in Thailand where it rains a ton, standing in just a complete downpour taking pictures as long as you don't submerge them like really submerge them they're actually very very waterproof so uh have no fear if you're a canon 7d canon 5d aficionado all right but now the lens has raindrops on it so i think i'll bring it inside Thank you, Mackie. Ugh. For the rain jacket. Almost done with the hill. Almost done with the hill. The weeds are already popping up. You gotta attack them early if you want your grass to be weed free through the whole summer. I'm actually maybe a smidge late. 
but we're gonna get her down now and you got to do it when it's the ground is wet and moist or else the fertilizer will burn your grass so if you're getting your yard ready for the uh, summer and now this is especially true in Colorado where you are around the country it might be different because you know moisture content soil types all that good stuff all right let's go Once the fertilizer's down, not a bad idea to throw some water on it with a sprinkler unless it's like a torrential downpour happening or right now, which it's not really raining anymore, so sprinkler. And shout out to our neighbor who sadly is moving, but that was their fertilizer that they didn't need anymore, so appreciate it. Thank you. That bag probably costs like 30 bucks, so... So about, about 12 months ago, we started scraping the house for a paint job and we never finished. And you know, life gets busy. So I did buy this stuff about 12 months ago. It didn't really work. It's paint remover. I'm gonna give it another shot. No reason to let it sit around. So basically it helps the old paint on your house bubble and then you can scrape it easier. We'll see. It's working. It's working. Come on. Come on. It didn't work like 12 months ago. I think we didn't put it on thick enough. You just got to lather it on real thick. And look at this. That's, that's old paint. Just needs to come off for the paint job. And that is the question of the day. What should we paint? What color should we paint our house? Huh? You got an opinion? Any ideas? Think of uh, the main color and then accent colors on the trim. Comment below. Do you have any ideas for us? Right now it's kind of a grayish, no sorry, a, a tan brown. And you know, it's fine, but uh, we want to spice it up a little bit. I think I've found four layers of paint. Look at this. You got your tan. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Just eating the last of the cottage cheese pie from my dad's birthday yesterday. If you did not see that vlog, go check it out. Mmm. Yes. Cottage cheese pie is an actual dessert. And it's delicious. I love it. I love it. Maybe not as much as pumpkin pie, but it's pretty close. All right. Eat beauty. Work hard. Love each other. And we will see you tomorrow. It's going to be a fun week. It's going to be a fun week. Stay tuned. Keep coming back. Thanks for hitting that like button, appreciate it. And uh, most importantly though, commenting below. All right, see you tomorrow. AC Neistat, you're stealing my ideas. You're stealing my ideas, buddy. All right, all right, now who is Casey Neistat? In case you don't know, he was a YouTuber who picked up the daily vlog for uh, the daily vlog lifestyle for about 18 months. He's no longer doing it, but he was very successful because he was very good at it. So Casey uh, has stopped daily vlogging. He stopped, I, you know, everyone has mixed opinions about that, but you know, whatever, it's okay, Casey. We've, forgive you. It's all right. It's all right. No, but for real, he stopped because he originally started making videos as a YouTuber. So making videos that weren't a daily vlog, just videos. And that's great. And he's upgraded recently to newer cameras. So in this vlog right now, at a glance, you know, if these white stripes are lined up here, then it's as wide as it'll go. If you look at the camera and it's like that, you're like, oh, shit, it's zoomed in. Bam, like that. 
and it's as wide as it'll go and you never need to check. I hope that makes sense. I know it's wide right now because these white stripes are lined up. He borrowed, in my humble opinion, Casey, if you're watching this, you borrowed an idea from me because you did that, uh, sorry, March 25th, no, 24th, you filmed that, 23rd, 2017, whereas I filmed this four months ago. <laughs> camera the big guy so when it's on green when the green is lined up that means it's in focus close up so you want to know when you're talking. in focus and out of focus so he put a little white mark and you're seeing it right now on your screen but everybody I did that I did that four months ago Casey all I'm saying Casey is uh I'm ahead of the game with you, buddy. Yep, yep. I got you by four months. I got you by four months on this one. Great minds. I guess, think alike. You know, think alike. So.